Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're all having a lovely day. Thank you so much for joining us again for another Too Good To Go review. Today's Too Good To Go review is from Baines the Bakers in Stirling. We have had a bag from there before, so let's see if this one is any good. There's quite a lot in this bag. It's quite, it's quite full today. Um, probably one of the heaviest Too Good To Go bags we've had for a wee while, so I'm looking forward to seeing what's inside. Is okay. So the first item is, oh there's several things in here, one, two, three, four, so can't might not be able to see very well but there are four sugar ring donuts in there. We have some sort of pasty pastry type thing, smells like Smells like beef and onion, so maybe mince and onion sort of pastry there. Um, it does smell really good, and it looks it looks perfect to be honest. You know, there's no qualms about that. The next item is a pie, and this is a Scotch pie, I think. Perhaps a, a steak and onion. A steak and gravy pie, I'm not quite sure. Um, I've noticed that in Baines, the, the, the pie toppings for the sort of um, scotch pies, like the sort of traditional ones that I would expect to see, um, can sometimes vary. So sometimes they've got a lid like this, and then other times they have a lid that is just like an extension of sort of um, short crust pastry, but with like the sort of semolina kind of crunchy topping on it. Um, so yeah, I've noticed that about beans, but I think the last time we got them, the taste was excellent and it was really nice, so I can't complain. We have another pastry product. Um, I think this is called a bridey, um, correct me if I'm wrong. But yep, this is a bridey. I'm not sure what's inside of it, but it does smell like beef, so maybe a steak one, um, a minced beef one. Yep, it doesn't smell sort of like oniony or um, sort of, you know, you get the cheese and onion ones. It doesn't smell like that, so um, I think it is more meat based. We also have another pie. Um, We've got a lot of food here, haven't we? Um, the last item, the little bag's empty now. I've noticed that they've started using sort of compostable bags as well, which is really good. I quite like them, they're nice and soft. And we have a fudge donut. So it's all sort of covered with the sort of greaseproof paper type stuff. I don't know if this one's filled or not. Um, it feels quite heavy, so I'm going to presume yeah, it is. It does have a sort of custard filling inside, which I'm sure will be lovely. Um, and this sort of film does peel off really nicely on top. It doesn't ruin it. Um, I know with some other sort of fudge donut toppings, as soon as you put the greaseproof paper on top, as soon as you take, take it off, it just takes all of the fudge coating off, which is the best bit. Um, so that's a bit disappointing, but this one seems to be absolutely fine. So all in all, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six bags of food, and obviously we've got the four donuts in there. So we've got 10 items all in all, and we paid a total of just three pounds 50 for all of this food, which is absolutely amazing. Um, when I hold it all up like this, and you think £3.50 for all of that is excellent value. I'm really going to look forward to this. Um, on a Monday night, we have quite a busy night after work, um, just with some um, sort of clubs that Logan goes to. So it means that we can have a quick dinner, we can save ourselves some money, and we also save all of this lovely food from going to Food Waste, going in the bin. 
So the original price should have been £10.50. Even at that, seeing what we've got, I struggle to, struggle to believe that all of this food would only cost £10.50, um, especially in the world that we live in at the moment. But if that's what the Too Good To Go app's telling me, then that's absolutely fine, I'll go with that. Um, but yeah, as we said, we paid £3.50 and I think this is probably one of the best Too Good To Go bags we've ever had for the variety as well as the quality of the products. So as always, thank you so much for watching. I hope this has been useful. I'm really looking forward to tucking into some food because I'm really hungry and it's been a long, long day at work. So yeah, for quick, easy, easy food and um, you know less hassle, this has worked out perfectly for us today. So I'm really, really pleased about that. If you guys agree, if you have any comments to make, please leave your comments in the box below. And if you're not already a subscriber, please remember to hit the bell button and remember to subscribe before you leave the video. So thank you so much for watching and we'll see you on the next one. Thank you. Bye.